Love Santa. It's my most recent book, just came out in October. There's this correspondence between this little girl and Santa. We have these little removable notes that go back and forth. So this is the first one. And she's just asking questions that typical kids ask. Does it get cold in the North Pole? What do you do for the rest of the year? She's just questioning kind of what Santa does. And, uh, and then Santa writes her these letters back. It's really interesting, this relationship this girl has with Santa. At the same time, she's aging. She starts out as a five-year-old, six, seven. And so what was fun for me as an illustrator is to figure out how a five-year-old writes the word Dear Santa or to Santa versus a six-year-old versus a seven-year-old. And it's quite different. And, you know, as they, they age, they ask different questions. The challenge of this one is that the story is very abstract. Um, it's not just a, a book about Santa. It's a book about uh, the feelings behind Christmas. It's the idea of Christmas as, as, as a feeling. And Christmas is the idea of love and, and giving, which aren't concrete things to draw. How do you draw Christmas as love? <laughs> Very difficult. It's easy to illustrate Santa, but how do you illustrate uh, the feeling of Christmas is magic, or Christmas is the love and the feeling behind Christmas? And so it gets into these um, more narrative ideas, more abstract ideas. So how do I show that? And so, you know, a page like this where she's sitting by the window and reading in this warm kind of light, this kind of cozy, cozy feeling. It's a very sensitive story. It's delicate, it deals with just emotions and, um, and it's tricky and the subject matter is tricky. And so I, I loved it. It was a lot of fun. It was really hard and I struggled with it quite a bit, but I liked the result.